Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with a Sasagura Aroma haul. So this is a sampler haul. So back, oh, I don't know, a couple weeks ago, two, three weeks ago, she had offered a bakery sampler and a fall sampler in her little bee and honeycomb shapes. I was gonna do one of each and then I decided, I have a lot of bakery from her. So I decided to do two fall samplers. I love fall. I love fall scents. Um, I do have a big bin of fall, but I know a lot of it will get cleared out this year. So I thought, okay, these I can hold on till next year. Um, typically with my fall scents, I do hold on to them and melt them the next year. That's just something I've always done. And so I thought, okay, I'll just grab two and you know, we'll go about our day. When I tell you guys how impressed I am with these scents, is an understatement um they are absolutely amazing I'm trying to find my samples okay so because i ordered two she usually sends you know one sample per order but since i ordered two samplers she did send two samples even though they were both the same order the first one is milk and chamomile type and i'm not sure how i feel about this one and this one oh my god i really hope she brings this out in brittle or loaves or something it's earl gray and apple this is amazing. Oh, so, so, so good. <clears throat> All right. So again, everything here I have two of. So I'm just going to start and pull. Some of these are being offered this week. One was originally in Lowe's and I was so excited because it's probably my favorite out of all of them. And now it's gone. She took it off the list. And I was like, dang it. Because <laughs> I really wanted a loaf in that scent. All right, so the first scent I have is Be Amazing. And it is citrus, cinnamon, mac apple, raspberry jam, peach, sugared vanilla, and cranberry. This one's okay. It's not my favorite. It's got some stuff in it that I'm not, you know, I wouldn't go for usually. But look how beautiful these are. I could probably cut these in, I would say, quarters. It smells good. It is nothing that I would buy regularly but I'm happy to have it to try because you never know like on warm it may throw my socks off and I may go oh my god where has this been all my life that's why I love samplers because you don't have a huge amount in case you don't like it but if you do like it you've you've got enough to actually make an opinion so like I could melt this in my warmers twice for one of these and then I have two so I can actually melt it a second time and go oh yeah I do like it or oh no it's really not for me you know that type of thing and the next one that I have is a bee sensational this one is red apple peach cinnamon wildberry jam clove vanilla and tonka bean that's the little yellow one and this one's pretty good um the wildberry jam is kind of throwing me off. I don't know why. All right, the next one that I have, this one's probably my favorite color. Be established, smoky woods with sweet and spicy notes. So this is probably my second favorite out of the whole bunch, but this is that like light blue teal color. This was the color of Roberts and my wedding because that's our favorite color is teal this one kind of reminds me of like a bonfire bliss but there's a sweetness to it like a bonfire bliss with marshmallow is what i how i would describe it oh, there's a hair like on my nose and it's bothering me every time i go smell anything yeah this is really good so this is actually offered in the brittles um this coming week so i will be grabbing two brittles of that as well the next one is Be Remarkable. This one is pumpkin, clove, roasted pecans, maple bourbon, pie dough, twisted, oh, toasted oak, vanilla, sugar, and butter. This one also um, kind of surprised me with how much I like it. I was kind of afraid that all those, um, like the oak and the clove and stuff was going to make it way too like spicy for me but it's actually really good all right the next one is be extraordinary and this one's pumpkin puree nutmeg vanilla rosemary woody <laughs> tonka bean citrus pine clove and sugar and this one's 
pretty good also. That, that rosemary you can really get in there, so it's kind of interesting. And these I would melt in the winter as well. All right, the next one is Be Bold, and it's Warm Cozy Blend of Bold Spices and Spicy Cinnamon. This one I was scared of because I don't like spicy cinnamon. But it's got kind of like a sweet note to it. Like it's not all spice, so I may be okay with that. I may actually pick up um, the next time it's offered. Actually, no. I have Pink Sugar Birthday. So I'm thinking birthday cake and pink sugar would make this, uh, you know, bearable. So I think I'll do that. I think when I melt that, I will mix it with pink sugar birthday. I was going to say I would pick up some plain birthday cake, um, but pink sugar birthday would work too. Just to kind of cut that spicy so much. All right. The next one I have is be happy. Pumpkin, ma maple syrup, clove, nutmeg, anise, anise, sorry, caramel, Sweet brown sugar, vanilla, cinnamon sticks, and tonka bean. This is another one that's really spicy, so I may have to cut it with the pink sugar uh, birthday. This Okay, so this one was my favorite, and this is the one that was originally offered in Loves. I had to go back and look at her edit history to make sure I hadn't lost my mind, because I wrote it down on my list. I made a list, I wrote it down, and it was gone. So I went ahead and I looked at her edit list to make sure that I was not completely like losing my mind and it was sure enough it was on there and, and then she took it down I was really sad um so this one is be delicious it's pumpkin pecan waffles marshmallow fireside cider lane blackberry and this one was I think Robert's favorite too oh, I love pumpkin pecan waffles mixed with um cider lane and marshmallow fireside oh, so good I'm really sad that she took it off the loaves because I'm going to my wax band starting Saturday and I thought, okay, she opens this Friday. That's perfect. I can get what I, you know, need to get. And then it, she took it off the list. Um, that said, even though I am going on my band, uh, pink sugar sleepy time is offered. Regular sleepy time is being offered this week. I won't get it. I need the pink sugar sleepy time. Um, but for me, the pink sugar makes a huge difference. Like I told Robert, I said, I'm going on a big wax band, but if pink sugar sleepy time is offered I will be getting it I do not even care <laughs> and there's a couple beach nights blends that if they're offered I will get them just because I'm not gonna run out you know for the sake of being on a band all right the next one's be special blackberry cider lane marshmallow fireside and marshmallow <laughs> this one's good I love her blackberry with cider lane and marshmallow fireside all right, and then the last one is B Positive, and this is Red Apple Vanilla, Wildberry Jam, Citrus Clove, Bay Leaf, Lemon Zest, and Nutmeg. And that's really good. Again, that Wildberry Jam just is so strong, and it just kind of throws me off. All right, so that is everything for this order. Um, I do have, let's see... She should be shipping out, it'll be about two weeks, I think. She's shipping out around the 10th of August, the stuff from the July pre-order. So I'll have a video then, and then I will be ordering on Friday. Um, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I'll be ordering Friday. So I will have two more hauls for you from Sassy before I'm... Um, you know, I won't have any more after my ban. Like I said, pink sugar sleepy time. There's, I told Robert there's about five cents that I will buy if I'm low on or they're offered. Um, pink sugar sleepy time, of course. And um, there's a couple, a uh, midnight lace, which is Beach Nights Vanilla Lace. That's one of my other favorite bedtime scents. It's a very soothing blend. Typically, people wouldn't think of Beach Nights as a bedtime blend, but for me, the midnight lace makes it very soothing. So. Um, I'm rambling, so I'm going to stop now. <laughs> I will talk to y'all later. Thanks for watching. If you guys ordered the, this fall sampler from her, let me know what your favorite is. Um, I like all of them, but those couple that I mentioned are my favorites. The one with the sweet and smoky and then the one with the pumpkin pecan waffles. But I'm a PPW girl anyway. I love my pumpkin pecan waffles, so it is what it is. All right, I'll talk to y'all later. Thanks for watching. Bye.